that this time it involves our intelligence community. Uh, Ken, what have you learned, sir? Oh, shit. Fuck. Okay. MSNBC's Joy Reid is one of the dumbest people on the internet. She truly is, and that is a big statement. But she absolutely is one of the most ignorant people on the internet, and she proved that without a shadow of a doubt, and it is glorious to witness. And the fact that people from CNN are even calling her out is beautiful. This is a very, very, very ignorant person. And this is someone who's very much anti-Trump, has TDS, cries about Orange Man constantly, and has been exposed once again as a very ignorant person. It is so funny to watch this all play out. And MSNBC's having a very bad day. A very bad day, and we're going to get further into that. Okay, we're over on OutKick. Joy Reid is confused, doesn't know what 538 means. Have you ever taken your car to a mechanic, then found out he knows less about changing brakes than you? That's the equivalent of the average American voter watching MSNBC's Joy Reid. Reid is so confused, so uninformed on politics, that she doesn't even know what 538 means. Imagine being a political commentator for a major network and not knowing what 538 means. This is why the mainstream media is dying. This is Joe Biden's America. She represents Joe Biden's America. She represents Kamala Harris, someone that is not qualified, but because of identity politics has been elevated. That is Joe Biden's America. While taking a break from denouncing anyone who disagrees with her as racist, Reed tried and failed to give a history lesson. Here's the thing. The reason there's a thing called uh, at 538 is because 538 was the margin in Florida when the Republican SCOTUS reversed the 2000 election during a recount, making W the president. That's the kind of margin where races can flip. That's not what's up now. None of that was accurate. None of that. None of that was accurate. Not one single bit of that. This is a person who is paid by MSNBC to talk politics. Are you kidding me right now? These are the people that are declaring the election for Joe Biden. What? What? Absolutely failing upwards. The dumber you are, the more you fail, the more you are elevated in Hollywood and in the mainstream media. Holy crap. Holy crap. I thought, honestly, no human could ev could get a tweet this wrong. Literally everything outside of the 538 tag is incorrect. The number 538 is the margin of the historical 2000 election. It's the number of electors in the United States Electoral College. You know, the system that decides our country. Hence why Nate Silver's polling site took the name. The margin Reed is referring to is actually 537, not 538. And worst of all, the Supreme Court of the United States did not reverse the 2000 election. That's three devastating L's in one setting. Some would say a first round KO by the keyboard. It's never good when a mechanic is so bad, he makes a low key uh, or lowly competitor look competent. Even Jake Tapper of CNN. This isn't accurate. The margin of Florida was 537. 538 is the number of electoral college voters. The SCOTUS didn't reverse the 2000 election. Bush always led in every count. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. This is the same person, yes, that called Clarence Thomas Uncle Clarence. This is who we're dealing with, ladies and gentlemen. This is who we're dealing with. Does she still have this tweet up? I think she does. So I went to it. Let's see. She, Yeah, so she still got the tweet up. And it's got 20,000 likes. Has she given any clarification? Jesus, she's still tweeting. Okay, well, that was 17 hours ago. Okay, so let's go. Let's go to her account. Oh, my God. Two minutes ago. 30 minutes ago. 32 minutes ago. Okay, she's still... My God. 40 minutes ago. <sighs> There's too much here. It's just too much word vomit. 
whining about Trump. I'm not going to go through all this. My God, my God, um, forget that. Uh, that is absolutely insane. But this is who we're dealing with. This is who we're dealing with. What are the replies on Jake Tapper's? Um, oh, God, look at this guy. Blue check mark. Maybe shoot Joy a DM or a text instead of a quote tweet. Oh, my God. These people are pathetic. They are pathetic. Pathetic. Maybe, hey, 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 Ben O'Keefe, maybe, maybe Joy shouldn't tweet shit she knows nothing about. Maybe that. What an idea. What an amazing idea. Maybe Joy Reid shouldn't just invent shit and then tweet it. Maybe she should do the slightest bit of research. How hard would it be? How hard would it be? To simply Google what 538 means if you don't know. She literally invented what it means. She invented scenarios. And then this guy... Maybe shoot Joy a DM or a text. What? Maybe Joy shouldn't tweet to her... How many followers does she have? Maybe Joy shouldn't tweet to her 2 million followers. Things that are factually incorrect. But the victimization never stops with these people. It never stops. Oh my god. It's been a bad day for MSNBC though. Let's listen to this beauty right here. This is fantastic. Okay? This is fantastic. Has some new reporting on something that we talked about at the top of the hour. How the Trump administration is handling the transition with the incoming Biden team or not handling it, we should say, to a certain extent. This time, it involves our intelligence community. Uh, Ken, what have you learned, sir? Oh, shit. Fuck. <laughs> okay. I uh, think, think we lost Ken for a second. We'll try to get him back there. Has some new... Rep Listen, that's going to be that's going to be the reaction of the entire mainstream media when they start to realize what's about to happen. This will be memed to hell and back right here when they start to see what's about to happen. You prematurely celebrated, you prematurely declared Joe Biden the winner, and as things continue to progress, this is the reaction of the mainstream media right here. <laughs> yes look at <laughs> this is so great this is so great oh my god there's his excuse right there so sorry for the profanity so sorry for the profanity i used live on air I was experiencing some technical difficulties and mistakenly hung up on the control room, though my mic was still on. Oh my gosh. Like, <laughs> there's there's Pasovic right there showing the real clear politics layout. This is so good. Wow. I tell you what, man. Things are going absolutely beautiful right now we are seeing a meltdown across the board from the mainstream media uh joy reed continuing to prove that she is definitely one of the most ignorant human beings that we have ever seen um and just showing how failing and being bad is definitely the path in the mainstream media in hollywood to elevate yourself uh, wow, what a day. And it is not slowing down anytime soon. Things are going to continue to spiral out of control. You're going to see the mainstream media losing their mind. It is not going to stop anytime soon. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Smash the melee button. Check out geeksandgamers.com. Support us over there with a premium membership if you're interested. And we will talk to you later.